Hi, in this video today, I will guide you how to use the Visual Studio Code to work with C Sharp by adding a new class file. And in the new class file, I will create a new, a new method. And after that, in the static main method of the program file, I will call it to execute the new method of the new class. Okay, let's get started now. And here, click on the browser. And I will go ahead to create a new file. Okay, I will name it either um my class my new class my new class yes so you have to save this file in the cat cat extension because if you don't save it in the cat extension it will be not recognized this is a c sub file okay so here i will copy the code from this one put it here Okay, I will change the class name and the method. My new class. Okay, and the method in will be is publish. Public. I will be I will be return a number here. So it is a calculation. Number one. Number two. And here, I will return number one, and in, uh, number two. Okay, cool. And here, when you creating new class, you have to make sure it it will be located in the same namespace as we did in the program .cf file. Okay, cool. So now here back to the program .cs file, and we 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 create a new instance for my new class in this file. Okay. My new class. My class. Equal new class. Here. So here you have just created a new instance of the of this new class, and now execute the function my class dot calculate tension you have to provide the two integer number okay so here in this uh, demonstration i will hard code the number the number two and three okay this one i will print it out Person dot rely Okay, and now we can run it for testing. I open the terminal, clear this. Clear this. Okay, so now I will dot next run. Yeah, so you can see here the first thing it will print out the hello world message, and the second thing it will print out the total of the calculation of 2 and 3 and it should be fine okay cool i think that's all for today and after you finish this video you know how to uh, add new class file by using the visual studio visual studio code in the csap project okay and after that you know how to create a new method in the new class file and execute and execute it in the in the main method of the program.cs file Okay, thank you for watching and let me know if you see any issue. Bye-bye and see you later.